backstage at UFC 205. And man, what a night you had, Tim Boach. You just knocked down Rafael Natal in his backyard. He's a New Yorker. Tell me about that performance. Well, I had an idea I was going to be able to do it. Uh, my goal was to get the first knockout. I knew I hurt him early with that first punch, and uh, he got a little tentative, so I knew it was just a matter of time before I put another one on him. Well, you certainly did. You know, Rafael is a very tough competitor, a great Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner. Um, how much was that a factor in how you approached this fight? Uh, my approach wasn't <clears throat> much different from my last fight. Um, I knew once we started scrapping a bit, he'd probably really start working the takedown, and I actually heard his corner talking about changing level very early in the fight, so I knew what we predicted was in play, uh, but I knew it was just a matter of time before I landed that right hand, and uh, that's what happened. Certainly North Carolina seems to be a very positive influence on you right now. I put together two straight wins. Um, talk to me about the preparation and why that's been so good for you. Well, I'm still working with Marcus Davis. We just relocated. We uh, were up in Maine for a couple camps, and then he's down in North Carolina now, and we work really well together. Um, the formula hasn't changed. Uh, we, we've known what we've been doing is supposed to be successful. Had a little bit of a bad run, but that's fighting. Um, just a matter of staying positive, having faith in, in what you're doing, your coaches, the people around you, and uh, it's paying off now. I only see good things that come in the future. Yeah, what is the future? What does that in, like entail for you? Where would you like to go from here? Well, uh, certainly, you know, Natal was a ranked fighter, um, so I want another one, obviously higher up the ladder. I'd like to break into that top 10 again. I've been there before, and I feel like right now is my time. I'm going to go after it. And quickly, what was it like being here in New York on this card? Words can't describe it, honestly. It's just incredible. Uh, I had no idea I was going to be on this card. I wasn't one of the guys that was calling Joe every day saying, put me on the card, put me on the card. So when the call came, it was a total surprise. Uh, the timing worked out perfect. and. Uh, I think the biggest thing was just the first fight my son has uh, come to see. So my son was in attendance at Madison Square Garden for his dad's 20th appearance in the UFC. And uh, I got my 20th win tonight. So a lot of stars have aligned on this day. It's a beautiful thing, and I'm, I'm very grateful and feeling very blessed at the moment. Incredible, Tim. Congratulations. Go celebrate with your son. Go to, yeah. go to concession stand. Get something good. Yeah, let's go get pizza. <laughs> yeah, thanks.